We tend to think that all leadership is created equal, but this is not true. There's really two kinds of leaderships because there's two kinds of groups. There are groups that aim for proficiency, that aim to deliver the same thing at the same time in the same way every single day. That's a group like Union Square Cafe. A group, a great wait staff, tries for proficiency to deliver that performance. Then there's groups that are about creativity. That's a group like Pixar. They're trying to create stuff that's never been created ever before in the world. It's a very different kind of leadership. All cultures can be divided into two fundamental types. Cultures of proficiency, striving to do the same things every time, and cultures of creativity, who are trying to create something new. Now the key, each requires a different form of leadership. So if you're leading for proficiency, you should focus on establishing priorities, defining specific keystone behaviors, and flooding the environment with signals that link the two, basically give people a map of what to do. And if you're leading for creativity, you should focus on building systems that can churn through lots of ideas to unearth the right choices and to support people as they autonomously figure out what to do. Figure out where your group aims for proficiency and where it aims for creativity and signal accordingly.